They are songs of hope. We're getting to the tipping point now. We, what we did in year one was get the debris out, get the planning process in place. Getting things right is always better than getting things first. And getting things right is what the Central Church of Christ is trying to do. On the site where their former church once stood, the congregation gathered to break ground and start a new chapter. Life coming from death just has a symbolic meaning. It obviously it means a lot to the to the, the Christian faith, but it, it has a lot to, to mean to us symbolically here. You know, it appeared dead. It appears lifeless now, uh, but yet there's going to be new life that comes out of this and a lot of good things to come. City leaders were on hand to help celebrate the step forward. I just want to crush the cream and do a brown bread, and I should have come to the house and a lot of brown bread. <laughs> Mayor Walt Maddox says the monumental moment is a sign of the resilience of the city. Their spirit is infectious. It was that type of spirit that multiplied itself across the city. And that's why, indeed, we are a shining city on the hill. The citizens, like Central Church of Christ, who stood up, stood fast, and refused to quit on April 27th. The, the storm needed to blow away a lot of old things, a lot of old attitudes, a lot of old animosities. There's been a lot of a spirit of cooperation, a spirit of love, and, and a spirit of, of dedication to a, a vision for the future, and it's just been inspiring to me. Jameson says the tornado prove the church wasn't confined by walls, but what lies in people's hearts. Reporting in Tuscaloosa, Sarah Chovnik, WVUA News.